and counting. Oil and gas means big business here in the Mountain State, and Doddridge County is one of the hubs of it. This morning, the Mark West Sherwood Processing Plant was revealed to the public. This is one of the first places where the gas is refined before it makes it to businesses and homes. Nicole Porter spent the morning there. Nicole, how important is this plant to the industry? Plants like this are what makes natural gas into the product that is used by the public. Right now, there's one plant on this farm in Doddridge County. Construction's being done on a second one, and there's even thoughts for a third. Now, just down the hill, there's also an Antero well pad with four wells. That gas is part of what goes through the first plant on the Sherwood property. Oil and gas employees work around the clock to extract gas from the land. When the gas is considered rich, it has to make a few stops before heading to businesses and homes. They take the gas from a producer like ourselves and then they process it. This is where the Mark West Sherwood processing plant comes into play. Rich gas, which means it has liquid in it, needs separated before it can be used as a heat source. It has to have a certain level of heating content and in order to meet that quality specification, the natural gas liquids need to be extracted. Um, if you left the natural gas liquids in the gas, then the BTU, the heating content is too high and it's too flammable. That doesn't mean the liquids are useless. In fact, there's hardly any waste. And you can sell the natural gas liquids into the marketplace uh, for petro petrochemical purposes, uh, making plastics, for instance, and then also like propane can also be used for heating. Uh, butanes can be helped with the uh, refining process for blending. Once the gas is separated locally, it's shipped to other states before it ends up back in our homes. In this Mark West Sherwood processing plant, enough gas is separated that could feed to tens of thousands of homes and businesses. Governor Earl Ray Tomlin said the plant also adds to our workforce. This is the first phase uh, with the opening of this processing plant. There's been hundreds, hundreds of workers uh, you know, in the construction. There'll be at least 20 or more full-time jobs here, so it brings a great economic boost uh, to the state, and in particularly this one uh, to Doddridge County. He hopes the state will find additional uses for this natural gas, such as using it to fill up our cars so that we're saving money by using our own resources.